Oh, oh, it's about to start. You ready? Ready. Popcorn? Butter. Nachos? Cheese. Fruit beer with red licorice straw? Right here. <laughs> Maybe it's time we made our new movie. Good idea, Scoob. But first we need a trailer. Oh, oh, can you do the trailer guy voice? Hmm, well, let me give it a shot. <laughs> In a world destroyed by evil. Discover the epic origin story of the greatest team of heroes in the history of mystery. <laughs> Not bad. Nailed it. Ah! Oh. Hey. Oh. This mangy stray's coming with me. He's not a stray. Okay, then. What's his name? His name's... Scooby. Middle name? Doobie? Last name? Do. <laughs> <laughs> you said that we would always be Without you, I feel lost at sea I love it. The darkness I'll never take it off. Like the wind <laughs> we'd be riding <laughs> Aww. Uh, maybe don't do that again. I'm Fred. This is Velma. Hi. And that's Daphne. Hey. I'm Shaggy. And this is Scooby-Doo. Nice to meet you. Trick or treat. Hello? Whoa, whoa, whoa. Shaggy and Scooby were taken? Do you realize where we are? No. Look around, man. The clean, modern aesthetic, the cool blue color palette. We're in Ikea. the Falcon Fury. Did you say Ikea? Nope, I said Falcon Fury, just like you. Maybe this can lead us to Scooby and Shaggy. Trace amounts of mustache oil, 12-year-old scotch. Ugh, is the bad guy my dad? <laughs> I'm Sonic, a little ball of super energy in an extremely handsome package. On my planet, people were always after my powers, so I came to yours. It gets a little lonely, but that's okay. I am living my best life on Earth. What? Ow! Let the plate Sonic! Let the bitches mount also Sonic! Ugh, I can't with that guy. Uh oh. Uh. Ah! Super funny. Why are you hiding out in my garage? They're coming for me. If they steal my power, they could conquer the universe. You have to help me. No, I don't. Please, it's life or death. Super funny. Good morning, my rural chum. Mr. Dr. Robotnik. I'm going to give you five seconds to tell me where it is. Wait, don't hurt him. <laughs> Road trip. Woo -woo. This can't be happening to me. Oh my God, stop the car right what? now. What? The world's largest rubber band ball? We got to see it. No, this is not some fun family road trip. <laughs> eh, you're right. It was lame. Gift shop was cool, though. Whatever this creature is, I'm going to uncover the source of its power. Yeah, hey. ah! I just thought you might like a latte with steamed Austrian goat milk. Of course I want a latte. I love the way you make them! We gotta lay low. Let me show you how it's done. Hey, hey. So should we get out of here? Yeah, time to go. I always want to do this. Nailed it! Hey, hey. Uh-oh. Here comes the boom. How are you not dead? I have no idea. Oh, give me a big fat break! That was an illegal left, by the way. Oh, this one is cute. Let's keep him. Oh, come on. You've got car insurance, right? Why would you throw your life away for this silly little alien? Good time. He's my friend. Let's go! This is my power. And I'm using it to protect my friends. Let's go! Let's go! So, you're supposed to be Tom's best friend that he won't shut up about. Well, I don't see the appeal. 
<laughs> that is very gross. Let's go. Happy birthday, Mr. Adult Man. Oh, Mom. Black and gross. What was Dad like? His beard was scratchy. He had a goofy laugh. I wish I'd met him. I have something for you from your dad. It's a wizard staff. I wrote this spell so I could see for myself who my boys grew up to be. This spell brings him back. Back like back to life. He wanted to meet you more than anything. Bowie, Tooth of Zadar! How did you... I don't know, it just started! Hang on! Dad? Ah. Just don't stop part! Dad, you are in your house! Oh, oh, boy. oh. We've only got 24 hours to bring back the rest of Dad. We're going on a quest. All quests start with the Manticore, the fearless adventurer. You mean Cory? She's over there. Quick, somebody help me. These Griffin Nuggets were supposed to go out minutes ago. That's the Manticore? You guys are in trouble big time. Get in the vehicle. I'm escorting you home. I'm giving you to the count of three. Uh, OK. Wait. What are you doing? I don't know. Oh, son of a... I'm looking for my sons. Oh, they went on a quest. But don't worry, I told them about the map, I told them about the gym, I told them about the curse. <sighs> I forgot to tell them about the curse! The what? <sighs> Your boys are in grave danger! Hold on! <laughs> How are your boys doing a crisis? Oh no! We're dead, we're dead, we're dead! Not great! <sighs> Can't do it. We're not gonna see you, Dad. You can do this. I believe in you. My gut knows where to go, don't you, boy? Yes, you do. <laughs> I'm on my way, boys. Just stay out of trouble. out of sage and I am a sage, so it works out pretty well. I'm Patrick. My name means toaster in Celtic. Pretty sure it doesn't. The most amazing places. The lost city of Atlantic City. Boy, I hope we don't lose focus. Look, I wouldn't worry about us losing the... <laughs> Ice cream. Uh... And a hero. Let it ride, Patrick. Let it ride. Uh... You! you can bet on. Put it on L. Patrick, that's not an L, that's a seven. Seven starts with an L? Oh, that's weird. The SpongeBob movie, Sponge on the Run. This is gonna be like a buddy movie. Oh, I love your sense of irony, Patrick. Thank you. <laughs> I love my sense of ironing, too. What are you doing here in Somerville, anyway? Honestly, my mom won't say it, but we're completely broke. And the only thing that's left in our name is this creepy old farmhouse our grandfather left us in the middle of nowhere. Why'd you bring me up here? Entertainment value. <laughs> what is that? I don't know. Somehow, a town that isn't anywhere near a tectonic plate, that has no fault lines, no fracking, no loud music even, is shaking on a daily basis. Come to the dining table now! Hey, remember that one summer we died under a table? 
I found this in my living room. Whoa, killer replica. A replica of what? A ghost trap? There hasn't been a ghost sighting in 30 years. New York in the 80s? It's like The Walking Dead. Your dad never mentioned this to you? It's just my mom. My grandfather died. My mom says we're just here to pick through the rubble of his life. Wait a minute. Who are you? Call it fate. Call it luck. Call it karma. That everything happens for a reason. Come on, darling. <gasps> it has a gunner seat? We are gathered here today to join B and Thomas in holy matrimony. You're taking this so well. He's a good man. You hated this guy. We've grown very close. Welcoming a new parent. Not that close. A father. Father? Father? No, you're not my father. Peter! Peter! The ring! Right, sorry. Are you the author? It's really the rabbit story. I just wrote it down. Look, Dad! It's Peter Rabbit. Oh, I hate that I'm the face of this. He's a little naughty. What? Are you Peter? That depends who's asking. <laughs> Peter! Stay out of trouble! Told you he has it in for me. He was talking to all of us. I'm talking to you, Peter! Specifically, stay out of trouble! 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 If that's who they think I am, maybe I'd be better off without them. Travel on my head, travel on my head. Ah. Oh, come on. <sighs> what are you looking at, goody goody? You're going to turn me in? I'm no goody goody. Apparently, I'm a baddie baddie. Get out of here, scram! Baby, I know pain. Is your name Is Peter Rabbit? Yeah. I was best friends with your dad. My name's Barnabas. You're a fierce bad rabbit, just like him. Where are the rabbits? Back in their borrow, snug as a bug in a rug. I'm gonna live forever! Get back here! Uh-oh, spread out. Join them, frolic. Yeah, I can frolic. This is fun. I'm speeding up a little. I'm speeding up quite a bit. Oh, stop. Oh, oh. Oh. Help. Help. And that's why adults shouldn't do kids stuff. Ooh. Legend has it there is a tree in the Amazon that possesses unparalleled healing powers. And the arrowhead is the key to unlocking it. Stop her! Hello. Uh, just wanted you to know this has been mislabeled. <laughs> Shipping outlets? Of all the jungle cruises you can take in the Amazon, this one is undoubtedly the cheapest. But also the most thrilling. Heads up, coming through. Yeah. Look out! Marauders. Natives. Ladies and gentlemen, the moment you've all been waiting for. The backside of water. Steve's wonder of the world. We're headed up river to Lagrimas de Cristal. We must secure our travel. Come on. Hello? Not a good time. My brother and I are looking for passage up river. Please go away.
I have a lot of money. If you believe in legends, you should believe in curses, too. You're gonna beg me to turn back. Well, I look forward to disappointing you. 10,000 to bring you there alive. Dead is 15,000. Why should I pay more dead? Dead, I'd have to carry you. Dead's a lot harder, lady. Here we go. Oh, God, sorry, Frank. It's all right, strong form. I cannot swim. You booked a river cruise and you can't swim? The price just went up. What would you want to be known for on Earth? We only have a short time on this planet. You want to become the person that you were born to be? Don't waste your time on all the junk of life. What am I doing? Spend your precious hours doing what will bring out the real you. Brilliant, passionate you that's ready to contribute something meaningful into this world. I got the gig. I really need a haircut today, man. Can you fit me in? Whoa, whoa, sorry. Huh. Probably for doing this funny cowboy dance. <laughs> Great. Our world has never been in more danger. Human greed is what drove us underground all those years ago. To escape from your rapacious appetite. I warn you, boy. You are not prepared for the truth behind what you seek. dangerous place you never know what's coming I came up here because I didn't want to be around anyone and then I met Buck he was a dog like no other he'd been spoiled Out! Come on, Buck. and he'd suffered Come on. could not be broken. I don't know where you came from, but I know where you are now. Welcome to the last place on the earth. I should let him have a minute. Doesn't look like he's ever seen snow before. How do you feel about an adventure? Beyond all maps. We could go, you and I. Where no one's ever been before. See what's out there. Enjoying this. I never 
never saw him believe in anything as much as he believes in you. What do you say, Buck? Adventure of a lifetime. You've been sleeping for two days. In my bed. I am Christmas Flint, human female. I think you'd like me. I think you'd want to be my friend. Dad? I think I could be part alien. I sure as heck hope not. I worry about you, Christmas. Good afternoon, birdies. Who's excited for Jamboree? <laughs> There's something special this year, an opportunity to be a part of science. This is Dr. Prasad, all the way from now. Sir. We are putting together a record of life to launch into space. We will be recording people at the Jamboree. Raise your hands if you like to think about outer space. The girls. Want to be Birdie Scout? Want to go to Jamboree? Jamboree is a talent show? Is that you or is trash you? <laughs> Would have been good for you to be around other girls. Who knows I'll raise you like one of them hillbillies. Woo! Joseph, I want to be birdies. I'm not a girl. There's nothing in the whole book that says you have to be. To make a troop, we need a minimum of four scouts. Ah! You know I ain't your friend, right? Yeah, I know that. Smash this to come too. Ah! Want to help the most poor, struggling fools of the earth? Yes. Miss Eileen, be latest to glory. You just setting yourself up for your little heart to get broke. No, I set myself up to change my whole life. Be birdies. Birdies have a strict quality code. My boos are quality. Well, the only number left in the state of Georgia is zero. Oh, sir. Welcome, Troop Zero. We all got to win one badge each to go to Jamboree. Buy my cookies so I can be a woman of substance. Have fun and puke, Miss Rayleigh. Don't puke before you get the money, boo. Y'all suck at being girls. We ain't got nobody to show us how to be better. Be that one for us. But Jesus. Come on. What kind of world would it be if every strange little girl thought she could just do whatever she wanted? This is what God gave me to work with, and I'm gonna make it beautiful because it's mine. Well, we look forward to seeing what you little girls are made of. Uh huh, what is it, Angel? We're made of organs and tissues. <laughs> Let's fall out. Life comes at you hard, you sit at home fire. Don't do nothing half ass. I don't wanna do anything with half an ass. No! Go. Your mom went to Peachtopia. I've been told by many cats about that legendary place. Let's go find her! What are you doing? I'm going to Peachtopia! Cats aren't birds. Cats can't fly. Hey! He's really flying! What's that? Looks like a cat! Really? There's a cat on it! We have to save him! <laughs> He saw where Kate landed. How can we see that photo? Mm -hmm. Let's see the paraglider photo. Huh? A parrot? Why are you looking for Peachtopia? To find my mother. But it's dangerous here. Easy to get in, hard to get out. You better run, little cat. Over there! Get him! I've got to find Kate. I'm going now. No way, no way. Uh. I'll go. You're both useless. I have toys. Stuff toys. Buy two, get one free. Get ready. Almost there, guys. This place is of no exit. We're in, not going out. Oh, my dad's gonna save us. We're getting out of here. Uh. What? That's great! You're the best! Oh.
shall I tell you a story? It's the story of an orphan girl from a faraway land who was sent to live in a mysterious house. And what if I were to tell you she discovered something magical? Something secret. Would you believe me? If you cause me trouble, I'll have you sent away in an instant. I knew you were hiding something. This garden, it's capable of extraordinary things. Now will you believe in the magic? Look guys, it's Carl. He's on probation. He's got a baby panda. <laughs> Don't mess it up, Carl. <laughs> Can I stay at your place for a while? No. We make perfect partners. Forget about it. Oh. <laughs> Come on, you know you want to. Mick, <laughs> hmm? huh? Mick, why did you order this? I didn't. Their big problem. He's so cute. He has to go back to his parents. They're probably where he's sick by now. Calls for a big adventure. Pandas live in bamboo forests far off in the south. If we sail down the river, it just might be doable. I can help with the supplies. A noble mission? I'm so honored. Come on. M me? You're too scared. <laughs> I'm on a quest to find this baby's parents. Want to tag along? Looks like I finally found a friend. What are you waiting for? Come on! From a writer of Madagascar. Everybody freeze! Way ahead of you. I'll carry your love. I'll carry your love. Comes a story of friendship. We'll be like Batman and Robin. Like D'Artagnan and the Three yeah. Musketeers. Like Dolce and Gabbana. Ta-da! Teamwork. <laughs> <laughs> and family. Look, everyone, our baby is all grown up. Featuring the voices of Drake Bell and Polly Shore. You gotta lift up! You're stuck. You've got a problem. The Big Trip. Whoa! I can fly! Woohoo! Guess it's time to introduce myself. Long start. Just three ounces of pressure to the vagus nerve, and then look at your boy, Sleepy Night Night. Lance Sterling, a legendary spy who's always dressed to impress. Walter Beckett, graduated MIT at 15 and works in the Tech Innovations Lab. There are so many gadgets I want to test in the field. For example, the inflatable hug. Kind of a personal protection device I've been developing. This is a vile waste of taxpayer dollars. This is your next objective. None of our agents can get close to him. I have something that can help. It's called biodynamic concealment. Imagine if I can make you disappear. Uh, hey, Lance, look at me. Look at you? I can see my butt and your face at the same time. That is so cool. Being a pigeon can make you an even better spy. Pigeons are everywhere and nobody notices them. Huh. Oh, 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 oh. In fact, pigeons can see in slow motion. <laughs> was tight. Did anyone else see a, um, a, a pigeon? And pigeons can fly up to 92 miles per hour. Don't you throw me off this roof!
He'll figure it out. All right, Kamura. Starting. It's about to get messy. Time to go. Sleepy night night. I miss my hands. I gotta stay. We have different skill sets. That's what makes us such a great team. Walter, you're squeezing too. Oh! What happens in the submarine stays in the submarine. Intelligence. Stamina. Courage. And heart. My business is dogs. He's undersized. He's trouble. Well, good afternoon. He's untrainable. Stop that! What does he bring to the breed? The heart of a survivor. He outran every single one of them. He's not a sled dog. He's a lead dog. What we have in our children is an epidemic. It's a death sentence. They found a cure. Round trip is 600 miles. You see that storm in the horizon? Only one man and one dog can make that run. He's 12 years old. He's too old. He'll never make that distance. Got one more in your pump. My guess is we don't find him till the thaw. All right, Togo. Time for us to find out who we are. I always thought he lived for the sled. was me.